I uh, wanted to ask you, um, it seemed this afternoon that your, uh, your command on the slider and the uh, off-speed pitches seemed to be pretty good, but it really seemed like the, uh, the issue that bit you today was fastball command. Would you agree? Uh, no, not really. I uh, thought I commanded the fastball pretty good. I got a little, um, I got a little cute with the first hitter with Van Meter and, and wound up walking him. I should, probably should have got more aggressive in that at bat. But other than that, uh, I hit a lot of spots that we were trying to hit. And, um, you know, with I, what I thought were pretty good quality fastballs, um, you know, it's, a, it's about as hard as I can throw a baseball most of that inning and was hitting uh, pretty close to what we were trying to trying to hit with the, with the as far as location goes. And they were on it. Uh, so, you know, it's it's one of two things. It's either they it's either, uh, you know, the sequencing is getting too predictable or uh, they know what's coming. It's one or the other. So can we talk about that sequencing for just a second? I know over the last few innings you've pitched, you've given up, I believe, about 14 hits. Do you think that may be biting you in these circumstances? You know, we're going to we're going to get <clears throat> I'll sit down with coaches and, and uh, catchers as well. And we'll address that and see what where we think that's coming from. Um, like I said, it's either sequencing, getting too predictable um or or i'm tipping or you know something else so i i i just uh i think we'll we'll address that i feel really good throwing the baseball i can't i can't throw the ball much better than that as far as just just strictly looking at pitch execution um yeah there's a couple missed spots but like i got away with balls in those locations earlier this year looking to last year early in my career like you know, there's just some pitches that they're getting to and taking really comfortable, good swings on that, uh, you know, just I'm not used to seeing that. Thanks for the time, Daniel. Yeah, thank you. Uh, Thomas? Yeah, I think you touched on it, but I, at any point in your career, did you feel like you were throwing the ball as well and getting as negative a result? Never. No, That's a, this is it's very strange to feel really, really good about your delivery, um, sequencing of, of the way my body's moving, um, feel for the breaking ball. You know, I've found some good change-ups that just haven't, you know, maybe landed exactly where I wanted. But but overall, like, three quality pitches I feel good about right now. And, um, yeah, the results just aren't there. Yeah, um, e even the games before this where the numbers didn't turn out right, did you do – a big kind of a big inquest into whether you're tipping, whether they know what's coming or anything like that, or is now the time that, Hey, it's obvious. I need to do something. We've, we've looked into it a little bit. I've had a few guys uh, look at the video um, more on the hitting side to see like, Hey, if you're facing me, do you see anything? And um, so far we haven't come up with anything. So it's either, you know, we'll, we'll keep digging into it though. Okay. Thank you very much.